Hi, my name's Tadej, and in this video I'd like to show you how authority and persistence work in coherence, and how you can easily test both locally and in the cloud. Coherence is a multiplayer engine and platform that allows you to easily build anything from session-based games to persistent virtual worlds. One of the most interesting aspects of coherence is how it handles authority. Every networked object has two types of authority, state authority and input authority. Authority over a networked object can be held by any node in the network. This can be, for instance, a client or a dedicated server or a simulator, as we call it. The API allows you to request authority over any object at any time, and you have full control over how and when the request is approved. The transfer will happen instantaneously. This allows for a high level of flexibility in both how your game distributes load and makes changes in the game world, regardless of if your game is peer-to-peer, -peer, client server, or a combination of both. All networked objects in coherence can be either session-based or persistent. Session-based objects, like for instance your player character, will disappear when you disconnect. Persistent objects, on the other hand, will remain in coherence and wait for another node to continue simulating them. As soon as these orphaned objects are adopted by any client or simulator, their state will continue updating. Objects can be configured to be automatically adopted if they are persistent, but there's nobody currently simulating them. Which means that if their state authority disconnects, and we, for instance, connect or have connected a dedicated simulator, their simulation will continue. All these features can be run fully locally or in the coherence cloud. From the editor, Windows, Mac and Linux builds, consoles, or even in the browser using WebGL. And the best thing about it is you can build and deploy both simulators and builds directly from your editor and use the Coherence online dashboard to configure a project, view logs, and even share your builds with your friends and colleagues. Thanks for watching this quick video about authority, persistence, and testing in Coherence. If you want to learn more, head over to our developer portal at coherence.io.